Welcome back to the Traders Network Show, broadcasting worldwide on equities.com. I'm Matt Bird. We're here in Davos, Switzerland, covering the 2019 World Economic Forum. And we're at the end of the week, and we're with the man who is the talk of Davos right now, Valentin Preobarzinski. Did I get that right? Yeah, yeah. Hi. Uh, so, Valentin, you are the founder of LA Token. You're also hosting the Blockchain Economic Forum. And it's at the end of WIF, and all everybody's talking about is Beth right now. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, you're welcome. Tell us a little bit what's been happening over you know last couple of days. Um, you know, there's a lot of chatter out there about what you're doing at LA Token and how successful you guys have become. Um, so, give give us a recap on on what what some you know we've got some some headlining guests and you had some amazing talking points. Give our audience a little bit of an insight. As yeah, so La Token is a digital asset exchange, it's top twenty by Coin Market Cap daily trading volume. We create trans border money and asset markets. Uh, and we organize a blockchain economic forum to gather politicians, economists, t t and regulators to discuss how this market should work. They are completely new uh, transborder story. Uh, money and assets are now available everywhere where internet is available, and um, several billion people can get access to this. Uh, they do not have access to fiat banking system now. They, they have access to all of the currencies and assets on uh, our exchange. Uh, and uh, this blockchain economic forum uh, made a few sensations. Mm. One is the sensation for me personally is that President Bulgaria organized uh, blockchain meetups. Yeah. And he's a big fan of blockchain. He uh, told this uh, on our blockchain forum. This I, was surprising. You know, I actually I saw a little bit about that. Um, I also saw some of the other interviews that you, that you, had, you had on your website. Um, do you want to tell us a little bit about what, what you guys went over on, on, on those panels? Uh, so first panel was uh, about capital markets on blockchain. Mm -hmm. uh, it, it was started for by president of Bulgaria. Uh, he uh, believed that uh, uh, European Union uh, can have a payment system on blockchain. Mm. Uh, and um, there was a uh, also discussion if uh, uh, this uh, capital market should be available to retail uh, clients or only to institutional or only to qualified investors. This was a big debate about rights uh, to participate for uh, people uh, who may be not as educated as qualified investors. Well, this is a terrific topic for you guys especially. Yeah. Um, and getting this stuff out there. I mean, we're starting to see a consolidation of technology and crypto exchanges and some regulation, bringing them, bringing them together a little bit. The decentralization is incredible. I mean, we saw Tim Draper's interviews. We, um, I, we actually see something with you in an AI machine, which was outstanding. That was, uh. that was one of the coolest things I think I, I had to come across. But listen, we, we, we get, we're running, we're running short on time. Um, can we? Tell the audience a little bit about what's up next uh, for LA Token. I know you have a few more events coming in the, uh, in the rest of the year, 2019. Yeah, we are planning events in uh, London and in Taiwan. Uh, it looks like Taiwan uh, government uh, is going to cooperate with us. We will bring uh, uh, VC crowd, uh, entrepreneurs, investors to their capital. Uh, and uh, uh, we will launch um, the Board of Governors to manage supply of mm. uh, cryptocurrencies for emerging markets, and we uh, gather high-profile economists uh, to this board. So our retail audience and our NASDAQ audience that's out there watching, um, can you tell everybody where they can go to find out more about LA Token? Do you have a website? Yes, our website is uh, latoken.com. And, uh, and it's latoken.com? Yes, LATOKEN. LATOKEN token. Token. <laughs> is a currency, it's a yes. fuel for trading. LATOKEN is uh, our company name. Uh, it, it started from liquid asset tokens. Uh, so it's, a it's, an it's an acronym. It's an acronym. Yes, yeah. Wow. Uh, so uh, anybody who has internet can access it and open account and uh, get access to uh, instruments which are um, available in his country mm. and in most of the countries, crypto is available. Uh, and if he wants to trade securities tokens, he needs to get through KYC mm. to be qualified for this trading. And here is a big debate for our forum that there are some people who are considered as well educated and well so they have access to venture asset class, mm. which is returning 20 plus, plus percent. Mm. So richer get richer. And uh, those who less uh, has less access to education and uh, money 
they don't have a chance to learn about this by trying, mm -hmm. making mistakes. And it's uh, easier for regulators to cut access rather than uh, pr make a fraud prevention regulation or marketing practice regulation or invest in education. And you guys are helping solve that problem. Uh, we, we are discussing. It's not our focus, uh, yeah. but we think that there could be a big, big benefit and uh, for governments, for nations, because the more, more people you have who have a skin in the game, who mm. invested in uh, the future of the economy and companies, they start to understand how news, how actions of politicians, regulators, uh, influence economy and influence valuation of their portfolio. So they start to uh, connect future with. Uh, today's actions and they became uh, more educated citizens and uh, better voters so they elect so they predict better the real benefit which politicians can bring to them and this change incentives for politicians and I'd, make I'd, policies uh, more sustainable i'd say we're out of time but you and i are going to sit down for one-on-one -on -one exclusive um and we got more content coming up in a little bit right now we have to cut to a commercial break you're watching the traders network show on equities.com don't go away Valentine's coming back for a sit down one on one inside because it's getting a little cold out here. Don't go away. Forum is brought to you by Salt, providing fintech solutions for digital assets. Visit them at saltlending.com. Special thanks to Russia House and RossCongress.org for hosting our show here in Davos in the World Economic Forum. And a special shout out to Burst IQ for their expert commentary and block.